So hi dear Leo, a very very good evening to you guys. This is Anjali Taro and this is a journal of reading for all the Leo Sun Moon Venus rising uh, for singles from today till the 10th of January. I'm going to tap into your current energies and I'm going to see who's coming towards you and uh, uh, the guidance for you guys as usual. If it's not resonating, it's not your story. Don't try to fit yourself forcibly into the reading, okay? If you want to be a professional tarot card reader like me, you can start your journey by purchasing my course. The link is in the description box. It's in simple plain English with lifetime access and uh, uh, certification if you want to start your self love journey but uh, don't know from where to start you can definitely purchase my ebook and workbook for the same and it's super loaded with a lot of information and super cheap too so let's start Leo your current energies right now at this present moment for love and relationship area are uh, let's see what's happening okay so we have the ten of pentacles the king of pentacles and the queen of cups okay five of wands uh, bottom of the deck so the thing is that you are trying your best to focus on job, career, name, fame, success and everything like that. You are trying your best to focus on self-love, self-care and self-healing. But at the same time, inside of you, there is a very chaotic kind of conflicted and confused kind of energy where, where your energy is all over the place. You are not able to understand what exactly you want in terms of love and relationship area. That is what is happening. It's like on the exterior, you are telling everybody, see, I'm focused on myself. I'm focused on my money, I'm focused on my job and career and my like uh, self-love kind of thing, my healing kind of thing. But inside of you, there is lots of uh, conflict going on regarding love and relationship. You're exactly not able to understand what exactly you want. That is why you're not able to make up your mind for something or someone. Might be there are options around you, but you're kind of not interested or you're uh, kind of not sure. Okay, that is what is happening right now in your current energies. The good thing here is that even if you are like having confused and conflicted kind of energies inside of you, you are doing very good in your life. You are doing very good in your life, right? Energetically as well and financially as well. Financial independence. You are creating some kind of financial independence base for yourself, for your future. Very good. Okay. Let's see who's coming towards you till the 10th of January, Leo's. Let's see what's happening. We have the Ten of Wands and the Page of Wands and the Eight of Cups. Okay. It's like somebody is entering in your life very, very quickly. And the situation is going to be so intense and so uh, stressful that they're going to leave as quickly as they're going to enter in your life. Wow. This is, <laughs> this is someone who might not be like talking to you right now. It's like very less communication happening. Then out of the blue, the communication is going to start. Then out of the blue, they are going to ghost you again. It's like... Somebody coming out to you after dropping the stress like can we be just friends, can we just talk, can we just hang out, can we be just like normal casual kind of hangout kind of buddies or something. So they are going to show up in your, show up in your life and the moment you are, you are going to give your attention to this person, the moment you are going to give in this kind of energy of okay, let's be friends, let's uh, have fun kind of thing, they are going to walk away. They are going to just run away from the situation. It's like a runner and chaser kind of a situation where one person is constantly running behind the other person chasing the other person and whenever they are going to get the attention they are going to just run away it's like entering quickly and leaving quickly and leaving you like feeling like dumb wow i think you should just uh, stay away from this kind of energy this could be a cancer pisces scorpio aries leo sagittarius sun moon venus rising it's an on and off kind of situation it's an on and off kind of dynamic that's that's already going on in your life it's not a completely new person I don't see a relationship. I do see uh, I do see a situationship or a friendship kind of dynamic that's converting into something stressful and intense. And one of you is not able to take it like lightly. So it's like it's going to be a game of runner and chaser kind of thing. So completely up to you if you want to deal with it or you just want to ignore it. It's your free will. Okay. Let's see the guidance for you guys, Leo, in the situation. Let's see what's happening. We have the judgment and the four of wands and the emperor. Okay. So before jumping in a, into any kind of conclusions that a, a particular person or situation is going to convert into a marriage or commitment or long term partnership kind of dynamic, I think you should deal with the person for what they are. I think you should see the person at least for the time being for what they are, what they are doing, how their energies are changing with you with time. Are they ready to commit? Are they ready to forgive and forget whatever happened? Are they ready to forgive their past mistakes or whatever whatever it is there are lots of blockages lots of things that they are going to come with 
it it's like going to be an elder person or someone who's very mature but at the same time this is someone who's very mature in love and relationship area like they are very mature when it comes to uh, finances or family kind of dynamics or giving good advices people are going to look up to them okay but when it comes to the relationship area they are going to be quite immature kind of person okay so before giving them a chance or before thinking about a future with them understand what they are and how they react to this kind of situations and then move forward because you might end up hurting yourself only see again chaos and conflict so this whole situation can turn into a drama if you are not going to be aware of the kind of person and energy that's entering in your life okay so just be aware <coughs> and understand the energies yep so thank you so much for tuning in leo i'll see you soon in the next video bye bye take care god bless you namaste